Hello everyone, my name is Elizabeth Pajowski and today I'm outside of 1719 Park Ave in Halethorpe. This house is on a huge corner lot. It's a third of an acre, but it just it seems so open and um, just seems like a really huge yard with a lot of potential. And as we come up the royal stairway, I love this entrance. I think anyone who comes over to visit when you have an entrance like this will really be wowed. And it's all a brand new maintenance free composite deck or composite stairs coming up. Then we have the nice covered porch. Notice the accents. So you can sit out and look down on the neighborhood from here. As we walk in, this house is just loaded with showstoppers. So you walk in, you see all gleaming hardwood floors. That's a brand new fireplace. That's a gas fireplace. But pay attention to the accents. You have granite, really nice detailing. And this is where your flat screen goes up top. Notice the nice custom lighting throughout. Sorry about that, the camera needs to get focused. There we go. Crown molding throughout. Then we make our way into the dining room kitchen area. Again, really nice attention to detail. So you have the hardwood floors, the unfinished marble tile, brand new cabinets and stainless steel appliances. Gonna pan this way so you can see. Looks right into the living room. Another cool feature that I know most people like is uh, self-closing drawers. Brand new granite. So over here to the right, this could be converted into a pantry, but right now it's one of two washer dryers. So laundry day could be cut in half with the two washer dryers going at the same time. Nice powder room for your guests. Some new vanity. Nice modern um, mirror and lights. First master bedroom on the main level. Again, the gleaming hardwood. This whole house has really high ceilings too, which is nice. Ceiling fans. Okay, so this is the first master bathroom. You'll see we have um, granite, granite accents throughout. So that's all new granite on the sink base. Tons of cabinet space. And then granite going throughout the custom tile uh, shower. Nice big bathroom. And your own closet walk-in closet. Again, I love the high ceilings and the nice little feature is that the walk-in closets have a pull-down um, ironing board. So you can do your ironing. Okay, and then next I'm going to loop around this way and show you this room over here to the right. This could either be your fourth bedroom or it could be an office, it could be a TV room, you have the cable hookup right there. Huge windows, which I love in this house. And I love the French door, so again, the French door could be replaced and this could be made into a bedroom. Or you could just have a continuation of living space. Love that fireplace. Then we're going to go upstairs, check out two more master suites. Both have tons of closet space and uh, their own bathroom with the custom tile, one of a kind. And this is what's really unique too, is right up here when you first walk in, you have your second washer dryer. So nice and convenient, you don't have to lug the laundry up and down the stairs. So this is the biggest bedroom, you have the closet there on the right. Big open space, high ceilings again with custom recessed lights. And then you have this huge walk-in over here. Again, it has the pull-down um, laundry or ironing board. 
And then you also have additional space behind, which is really nice. So tons and tons of storage. And as we pan around, really, it's really spacious, that closet. Here's the second master bath. This one has a soaking tub. Again, it's got the custom granite on the new vanity. Nice big mirror. Custom tile all throughout. Everything is shiny and new. It smells great. No cleaning necessary prior to moving in. Nice new plush carpet. Here's the third bathroom. Again, it's got the custom tile accents, nice tub, and the new vanity. So that's the third full bath. And then you also have the half bath powder room. And here's the third master. Again, a huge bedroom with multiple closets. Another walk-in over there, straight behind. A lot of space. And then the final place to check out is we can go downstairs and take a look at the yard and also the basement. It's got a full basement. Let's look around. The powder room and the kitchen. And here's the basement. The basement is semi-finished. It has carpet, freshly painted, nice and dry. Ceiling height is a little low though. I'd say it's about seven feet. So that might be intimidating for someone tall. But look at all the space. So there's a lot you can do with this. Storage, or again, you can put the pool table down here. Make this the exercise room. Huge. Something else that's really nice is you have the new train uh, furnace that'll last forever with the gas. Gas makes it last a long time. Energy efficient. Um, and then you have the new thankless hot water heater. So it's instant hot water, which is a really cool feature. Save a lot of money on your utilities with the instant hot water. Okay. And then the final place I'm going to show you is upstairs. We'll go ahead and take, check out the backyard. There is a wheelchair accessible ramp that can be removed upon the buyer's request. So we've got the ramp. Big backyard. There's a parking pad over here. You can make that a parking pad. There used to be a garage. So if you're just looking for a space to build a garage or a shed, you have that already right there. And then we'll hump around and show off the nice size of the yard. Nice and big. Goes all the way around. New siding. Most of the windows are new. Some were pre-existing, but about three quarters of the windows are new. So definitely come and check out this house today. It's humongous, very deceiving from the outside. I definitely don't think it'll be on the market long because you can't beat three master bathrooms. And please feel free to give me or my brother Steve a call. I'll be happy to answer any questions that you have. Thank you.